Again, I'm Kelly, and we have a, an audience behind us that thinks that we're pretty entertaining over here. Thank you. So um, they felt as though uh, we needed to show more of our personality, and I think really that if we go into conversation, Kelly and I, who's filming, we can get that out. So um, I kind of wanted to start by telling you about some of my bad relationships in terms of the Match.com and the eHarmony. Um, the first one that I went on, I ended up meeting a guy online, and he looked, he looked like a good-looking guy. He was from the same part of New York I'm from. I'm from Rochester. So the guy's got his t-shirt off and, the, and he's got the whole abs rocking, the hair's all out. So I'm like, oh, nice. From the same part of town, we're going out, we're going to have drinks. The guy goes, because I picked him up. He goes to get in my car, and don't you believe that this guy is bald and fat? And I was like, who the hell are you? We go out to the restaurant, he's rude the entire time. And I was just trying to keep it together, because he feels as though he's like, you know, I think he thought that he's some sort of big shot, whatever. So I ended up, I mean, I had the worst night ever. I got home and I had to relook at his photo. It was like a Jerry Seinfeld moment. Like I had to look at his photo and think back to what he looked like. I'm like, this isn't the same person. I said, by the way, like you don't look anything like your photo. He's like, oh, haha, ha, that was a few years ago. I'm like, that was like 15 pounds ago, buddy. And that was like 15 million hair, hairs on your head ago. So that shit's gone and shiny. So um, that, was, that was a date. I was also on a date with a guy that didn't look like his photo. And he had, um, he had a really, he had a booger coming out of the side of his nose. And I was just so disgusted the whole time. Like we had a drink at the bar and I was like, I gotta go. I'm like, you know, you don't look like your photo. Um, and obviously the awkwardness of the booger. What do you have to ask me? What, what can you ask me? <laughs> oh gosh. What do you like to do for fun? That's one of our like staple things to tell dates what to say on a date. Okay, right? say that. Say that. What, when, why, how? Who, what, when, where, why, how? I actually play golf because I work. Um, I, I worked in logistics, so supply chain management for a very long time, and it was just good for business. But the truth of the matter is, golf is nothing but boozing. Like, if you get on the golf course at 10 o'clock in the morning, you're boozing it up. If you're the first to open